Brand new street and brand new me Side by side by friends I need Don't you tell me that you're in town I already know, couple days ago Hey, now that our names are written in stone Let's be honest, sounds like home Still I'm here alone and I'm calling your phone I wish I could wipe my own memory out I wish I could dream about somebody else I wish I could talk when the silence so loud I wish, oh I wish I wish I could wipe my own memory out I wish I could do something that would make sense I wish I would know what you're thinking about I wish I could wipe my own memory out Sneezing on me. Got the hiccups. Oh, you got the hiccups. Oh no. Oh no. What you gonna do? What you gonna do about them hiccups? Say go away. Say go away, dad. Hiccups. Bell Bell. A Bell Bell. <laughs> A little Bell Bell. Check your feeders in. Oh. Oh. You gonna talk to Mama this morning? You gonna talk to Mama? What are you gonna say? What you gonna say? You got stories to tell, Mama? <gasps> yeah? What stories do you have to tell? Do you have good dreams? Do you have good dreams? Yes. Oh, yeah? You did? You had good dreams? Yeah. I'm glad you had good dreams. Yes. Good morning, guys. Um, I am heading, well, I'm trying to get the kiddos ready because we are supposed to be leaving to get Gwen to school. Um, she's at school this morning, so I'm trying to hurry up and get ready. So my hair probably looks a lot darker, um, you can see. 
I went and got it done the other day and it did not turn out the way I wanted it to. Um, she was supposed to do dark in the back, so it was supposed to be darker, but it was supposed to be like highlighted around the face. Um, so it's all right though. Um, she said it would probably take a little bit to get it to where it needed to be. Um, I feel like I hear that story every time I go to the salon, but I am going to wash my face, get my makeup done, and um, try to get ready, and then try to get the girls dressed, and I have to do some fruit. I have to put some fruit together for Gwen's school today, because they're having like a celebration at her school for um, Easter, so it's 7.50 right now, and I have to leave at 8.30, so I have like 30 minutes to get all that done. So Caroline is dressed. You want to show them your pretty outfit? You stand up. Yep, all ready. Ready to go. Pretty princess. <laughs> so this is my outfit for today. Um, I have like five minutes to get out the door. Um, my mirror is also really dirty, but um, I didn't have time to do my makeup, so um, I'm going to drop Gwen off and try to do it in the car. Alright, we're all in the car. Got the fruit, got um, diapers and extra wipes and stuff for the baby. Girlies are in the car already. Baby boy's back there. <laughs> but it is... 8.35, so we're running a little bit late. Get out, Gwen. It's time to go to school. So, when I was at the salon the other day, this was the look I was going for. And, um, as you can tell, it's nothing close to that. So, I just called real quick to make an appointment with them just to try to fix it a little bit. Um, because it definitely needs to be darker in the back and then the front should be highlights like towards the face. So, um, they did get me in, so I'm going to go back there at four today. But this is like what it looks like and like you can tell it's still very light. Um, all she did was a root smudge, so, um, she didn't do like any color or anything and the problem was is my blonde is still coming through like a lot. So it's lightening up a good bit and after I washed it, it lightened up even more. So it definitely needs to be a little bit lighter um, in the front. Like this needs to be like blonder and then behind here needs to be like all the, the same color as my root. Um, and I think she was trying to do that with just the root smudge, but it didn't work because as soon as I washed it, it just, it went right back to being blonde. So. Um, hopefully they can fix it and I won't look like crazy on Easter weekend. So I am back home now and this is my hair. Um, I don't really like it. It's definitely closer to what I wanted um, than what she did the other day. Um, she just darkened it up a good bit more. But the thing is, is it just, it looks splotchy on the right side. So there's like spots right here where I can see like where she had dyed it and it just didn't take or something. But it's closer to what I want it to be so it's definitely getting there. Um, plus she just air dried it. She couldn't really fix it because I didn't have time before I had to go pick up Gwen from school. The kiddos are passed out. But I'm going to go inside, get the kiddos in there and probably try to keep them asleep. Um, hopefully they'll stay asleep because they need to take a nap. Um, and then I'm going to try to, uh, maybe rest for a little bit and then I'm, I probably need to fold some clothes and stuff and do some things around the house. Um, I want to make, um, a little Oreo dessert that I saw on Pinterest. So I'm going to try to make it probably tomorrow though because I actually got M&M's for it, and the M&M's are the wrong type of M&M's, so I need to go to the store and get 
the right type of M&Ms. I need like the flat ones and the ones I got were like the peanut ones so they're not gonna work. So I got changed real quick and now we're out in the garage. Kiddos are over here. I'm gonna get a quick workout in before Josh gets off work. back at the salon today to get my hair fixed three days this week I have gone to the salon to get my hair done and I'm like about to cry every time I leave it um, some may say I'm crazy for even going back and even like trying to fix it again but it's Easter weekend and my hair looks like crap and like I paid hundred and forty dollars for them to do my hair and I never say anything and that's the problem. Like I always end up getting my hair messed up or getting my nails butchered and I won't say anything. And people just keep doing it over and over again. And I'm kind of fed up with it. Like, yes, there's like, you can be a Christian about it and not be rude to people. But at the same time, people need to not walk all over you. And I'm like done. Like this is my third time I've been here this week and I am going to walk in there and <laughs> I'm going to be firm with them and be like, hey, this is not acceptable. Like, you guys are professionals. You should know what you're doing. And if you can't do something, just tell me, like, beforehand, before you ruin my hair, that you can't do it. Don't sit there and act like you can ruin my hair and then be like, oh, I, I knew I wasn't going to be able to do it. And then make me feel bad for wanting that done to my hair. Because that's basically what this girl did. She just made me feel bad the whole time. She's like, Oh, I probably like I should have told you like that probably wasn't gonna work like I already knew that wasn't gonna work but she told me after she already had ruined my hair which is the crappy part so I'm frustrated and you can probably tell I'm really frustrated I went home last night and I already cried to Josh I was like really upset after I worked out I didn't want to video anymore because I was really embarrassed by my hair and I was like, I just don't want to, like, I don't want to finish vlogging today. So I picked up the camera today and I'm like trying to start fresh. Hopefully they will be able to fix my hair. Last night I prayed over, I was like, Lord, please help them to be able to fix my hair. Cause I'm just really stressed out about it. Like I've had this done to my hair once before and it was like three different colors and it looked awful. And that's what I was afraid of happening. Like I was afraid of that happening again. And of course it did. Like right now, um, it does not look bad. That's the thing. Like it's just this right side of my head that's like butchered. Like it just does not look like the left side. And that's the crappy thing is like, why can't you get this side to look like this side? Like if you're a professional, like my hair should look the same on both sides, not like a black spot right here. And then this all blending. But, um, the light's changing because it's really dark outside but um I'm trying to stay positive I'm gonna go in here and hope that they can fix my hair and hopefully it just works out so I'm done getting my hair done and this is what it looks like you can see where she put like 
color in to make it blonder on the right side. The only thing is, is it doesn't look like the left side. So this side is extremely bright. This side is like blended, but this is what I wanted my hair to look like on this side, but it still does not look like it. Um, so I don't know. I'm probably gonna go home and cry again, and I'm probably never gonna trust somebody at a salon to do my hair again. Um, but I'm gonna go get my nails done real quick, and hopefully just try to keep my mind off my stupid hair and try to stay a little more positive and just have a better day. So I'm gonna go get my nails done real quick and then I have to go to Walmart and get groceries. So I am at Kohl's right now. Just got spit up on, the baby just finished eating. I don't have no wipes and I don't have nothing to clean it up with, but I did get my nails done. I just got them done green um, for Easter. I'm heading over to Ulta because my face is like broken out ridiculously bad because of the birth control I've been on and um, the cover up I've been using I just hate it it just moves like non-stop and it doesn't stay where it's supposed to so I am going over to Ulta to pick up some more cover up and then I gotta get to Walmart to pick up groceries. It's super late, it's like six o'clock and I'm starving. So I'm gonna try to be quick so I can get home and eat some dinner. Happy Saturday, guys. We're at the, um, is it McGregor Park? No idea. Well, we're at the park down by the river. Um, we're having some lunch. Trying to get little one to eat her food. She never wants to eat anything. That is the tiniest bite ever, girl. You need to eat more. No, maybe eat more. one did not eat. So I guess it flooded was Wednesday. I think it flooded down here because the lake this is supposed to be closed off but it's like got logs and dirt all over it. And the baby's over here sleeping. I think the kiddos are gonna play for a little bit and then um, we're gonna try to head to Lowe's. We want to work on the garage today. Our plan is to paint the floor, um, but we'll hey see. Guys. I think it's supposed to be. Hey guys. <laughs> um, we've been wanting to paint it for a while, but I think it's going to be like a few days. Like it's a long project, so. Our plan is to put like half the stuff on one side of the garage, paint the floor, and then move everything to the other side of the garage, and then paint the other side. Um, <clears throat> but we gotta pick up the stuff today to do it. You having fun up there? Yeah. Yeah? Are you gonna be able to get back down? Yes, I think so. You think so? Mommy, get a yacht. Jump, jump down. For the tiny bugs. Yeah, and and then I eat the mina mushroom. So we got everything we needed from Lowe's, we think. Right? No, nah, we're good. Got all of it. We YouTubed it, for sure. <laughs> and then just basically And then bought all the stuff that wasn't on the YouTube video. <laughs> yeah. We're like, okay, we don't need all that stuff off YouTube, so we'll do it our own way. So that's what we'll we did. We'll see how that works out. So we did we think we got like all the stuff to prep it, prep the floor, and then we got like the scrub brush and uh thing for the roller, like a stick to put the roller on. And now we just gotta do the hard part, which is basically cleaning it up and um, 
moving everything out of the way so we can start prepping the floor and then painting it. Um, the thing is, is the YouTube video we watched on it basically said that it takes like three days to do it because she washed it like three times, didn't she? Mm -hmm. She washed no, it. Took her over a week. Yeah, she washed it and then let it dry for 24 hours. So like it took her like a whole week to do it because she did it in like really big steps. But we're trying to do it a quicker way. Hopefully it doesn't bite us in the butt and we can still make it look nice. Um, we also didn't get the same type of paint. We got like an epoxy, right? It was an epoxy yeah, same paint. Stuff. Same stuff she had. I thought she did like the... She bought the, the kit. We didn't do the kit. Oh. Well, okay, so we're on our way back. We had a good time at the park. Um, yesterday I got home super late. He was bad because I got home at like nine o'clock at night. Um, because oh. not mad, but you were just like, Why aren't you home? Like, like why'd you get she's home in so an late? Or something. She, she's gone. Yeah, she? because my phone died and then the baby had to eat like every two hours, so it took twice as long. And like, I, we took forever, like, did a bunch of stuff we're planning on doing and we still got back at like three six hours later she finally comes back <laughs> five hours later she says hey i'm on my way to walmart go ahead and make whatever you want at like 7 30 at night <laughs> like yeah i was just like leave some food for me because i'm gonna be starving by the time i get home and i was really hungry um, and as soon as I got home, the baby needed to be fed again. So I was like, I'm not trying to pull the camera out. Like I videoed a little bit of us unloading the groceries, but I was like, I cannot video anymore. Like I was so tired at that point. Um, so it's just going to basically be a weekend vlog for you guys. Cause I have been like all over the place doing like stuff around the house. Like we've been in and out of the house yesterday. We were out of the house the whole day pretty much because yeah. we were doing errands around town but um today we're supposed to be working on the garage it's um supposed to rain i think this evening it's already four huh? yeah it's already four i think it's gonna start raining though but it looked like today. it was gonna rain like all day today so i don't know um but we're supposed to work on the garage this evening and um then i, I wanted to do a dessert um and prep it for tomorrow because tomorrow's easter and I want to try to get some stuff like prepped for our dinner tomorrow. Um, but I'm going to take you guys along with us today. And I'm also going to bring you guys along with us on our Easter Sunday. Because we um, have our cute little outfits to wear tomorrow to church. And then um, I'm going to make like cute dessert and um, some yummy food for lunch. Kiddos are being pretty good today. Somewhat. This little one right here ran off in the store, didn't you? She ran all the way to the other side of Lowe's while we were getting paint and stuff. And she just ditched. And I thought she was with Josh and he thought, I guess, she was with me. So neither one of us were tracking that she was not with either one of us. And then I went to find her and she was with one of the older guys, I guess, older guys that work there. And she was just walking back where we were at and I was like I cannot believe she just ran off on us in the middle of the store but that's what happens when you have toddlers so um, we're gonna probably have a busy evening tonight Josh is somewhat excited about this whole project no, that'll be cool it'll look good it, it'll just be a pain in the butt getting everything out of the garage which I think we're gonna end up having to put in the living room no I don't know what I, to do. Like, it's so a it's, half, it's, and half thing. I don't think that's going to work. It, no, it it's not half weeks. and half. But listen, you move it to one side of the garage to prep it and clean it. And then move it to the other side of the garage to prep e it, clean it. Because each one of those steps, then, I think you got to wait like 24 hours. So you're just doubling the time to do it. Which I mean, I guess we could do. It's just, it'd be a minute. That little car is so cute. That's I don't know dope. what kind of car that is. That is so we need to get one of those. I got to show you guys this car. Gremlin Look at this little cute car. <laughs> These little AMC gremlin. Um, anyways, I'm going to get off here. We'll get home. We'll start on this project and we'll figure something out. We always do. Um, we'll probably fight a little bit because we 
always do to one of our projects. But we'll get it done. So this is what the garage looks like right now. It's a mess. This is Josh's side. And that's where we work out over here. I've got all this stuff over here, so I'm gonna work on getting this cleaned up real quick. Happy Easter, guys. Um, we just got out of church, and we are about to eat some lunch with Autumn and her husband and their three kiddos. Hey, bees! Tell them you look a mess now. You look a messy girl. Crazy girl. Your hair's all undone. <laughs> it's all undone. Me neither, bro. Oh, don't like. Oh, oh. She's trying to clean her face. And see, Josh is over here sleeping. Um, we're at Cracker Barrel right now, and it's about an hour wait. So we've just been sitting in the car waiting to get a table. Um, I went ahead and fed the baby and everything, but we're just waiting right now. Um, we let the kiddos open some of their gifts this morning, like their Easter basket and stuff. Um, they didn't really get to play with too much. Happy Happy Easter! Easter 2022! Happy Easter! Um, but we went to church this morning and they had a really good service. Bless you! Bless you! Um, but... I got sick last night. Well, I've been sick most of the week, but it got Mommy worse said. last night. I lost like my voice. Mommy said that. And Gwen right felt bad yeah. the other night, so I don't know if I got whatever she had. But we're all just kind of tired today. It's kind of gloomy out, but we're um, enjoying our Easter together. When we get home, I think we're planning to um, do a little Easter egg hunt, and then you want to call our Easter eggs? All right, so we have about another 30 minutes before we get to go eat. So we're just gonna wait in the car for a little bit longer and then hopefully we'll get some food. So we're back at the house now. The kiddos are running around. They have already gotten into like all their candy. They've been eating it since we got home. But the girls and I are gonna make some Oreos like dipped in chocolate and then put like little pink bunnies on top of it. And then we are also going to be hiding the eggs for the kiddos to find. So I'm gonna video that for you guys and then I will probably be ending the vlog out here because it's been like three days of vlogging and I just want some time together with the family and just to be able to enjoy the rest of the Easter Sunday with them. So um, I'm gonna video that for you guys and then I will end out the vlog. Also, I wanna show you guys real quick. Um, we did work in the garage a little bit more yesterday and Josh is out there working on it some more today. Like I said, it's like a few steps that we have to do so we can't finish it today and we couldn't finish it yesterday either. But um, he is working on the next step right now which is washing it and rinsing it, I think. <clears throat> It's cleaning up the surface so that the primer and the uh, paint will actually like stick to the concrete. So this gets all the grease and all the stuff that would keep it from soaking in off of it. It's probably going to melt my dang frogs, but whatever. Uh, you're not getting your hands in it, right? <laughs> uh, you're keeping your hands out of it, right? Yeah. It's raining outside, so I don't think we'll be able to do the egg hunt outside. <laughs> All right, girlies. <laughs> you ready to help mommy? I set up this stuff last night for them. I set um, this little garland up here on the stairs and then decorated the table. They've already gotten through their Easter baskets and stuff, but um. But baby Barbara got. No. He just really can't play with his stuff, but we can get it out and let him play with it later. So I decorated the table and then I just added these cute little stickers over here. So I got my I got my um, white chocolate chips ready to melt. So we're gonna put them in the microwave and melt them real quick. Hey, hey, 
got our Oreos, and then we got our little tray to set them on. Mimi, you put this on and, and get our empty. Yeah, maybe. And we also got these little bunnies to put on top of them. They're like little peeps, I think. I belong, I belong to you. Do just what you want. You're the one I trust, and I always be around when I need some love and baby. No one else. Yeah. Jolly Rancher jelly beans are amazing. Start your basket. I get this one. Here you go. Start looking. Where's your Where's your eggs? Where do you see them? I found one. Careful. Do 
better get it. What's it on it? Care Bear. It's up somewhere on the- Oh, my bear! Me get that one! Let her get ah! one. Gwen. Here's this, I got one more for you. Let's go find more. Is there any more? Okay, mm -hmm. keep looking. Yeah, uh, you check the chairs? <laughs> yeah, I think there is. I just, I just saw- What's like, here? Mom, it's yes, And the coffee table. Look, look in the bush in the coffee table. <gasps> I found a red one. <laughs> Sissy, where'd you find that one? <laughs> party, party, yeah, party. I have one by the diaper bag. I forgot about. <laughs> I think that's it. No, uh, no. I'll, I'll do one more deep search. I'm sure there's a couple more, maybe. Let's go check. Let's go check. So the kiddos. Got all their eggs over there. They're counting them and sorting their candy right now. But I'm gonna go ahead and end the vlog here because I'm super tired and um, we're still gonna try to work out. Right. Yes, we're working out. We're planning on it. We'll see. Um, we'll see. Wrap me up. But I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog and we will see you in our next video. Bye guys. Bye. Easter! Happy Easter! Sissy just Easter! <laughs>